What's up YouTube, my name is Synaptic, thanks for dropping by. DICE has been updating and releasing new content for the past few months. I wanted to inform you guys what to expect for the upcoming weeks and months. DICE is planning to release two new BF1 patches ahead of the Nival Knights release. In early April, the company committed to releasing monthly BF1 updates as opposed to seasonal patches. These updates will bring fixes for lingering problems and they'll also bring new features to the Xbox One, PS4 and PC. DICE is planning to release its spring BF1 update in April. The company hasn't confirmed a specific release date. The spring BF1 update will have tweaks, fixes and some new features including platoons. Sometime after that, DICE will release a May BF1 update which will include streamlining the flow into matches and improving many gameplay grievances that will hopefully make the action feel more balanced and fair. The May update doesn't have a release date yet. DICE revealed a brand new BF1 map called Nival Knights, which will be released this June for premium members. The map also promises to spice up the experience with its night settings. DICE describes the map as follows. As darkness falls over the muddy battlefields around Malmaison and Soupier, French and German batteries prepare to yet again support their troops on the contested ground. The moon, the searchlights and the artillery light up the night skies, exposing the vast network of trenches. Fight and hold as your foe will fight for every inch of ground. Strategy and teamwork will overcome those who have neither. Nival Knights is a free map that features the French and German armies battling against one another under the cover of darkness. Yes, this is the first BF1 map set at night. The map, which is set in Chamar de Dames, in 1917 features the muddy battlegrounds around Malmaison and Soupier in France. The images here from DICE media editor Petri showcase the Nival night map in amazing detail. The map features trenches, searchlight, the glowing moon and a lot of mud. DICE has released a new map into the BF1 community test environment also known as the BF1 CTE. The BF1 CTE is currently limited to Windows PC users, but DICE is expected to open up to the Xbox One and PS4 at some point down the road. At this point, we're expecting Nival Knights to serve as a bridge between They Shall Not Pass and the next piece of Battlefield 1 DLC. In the name of Tsar is the second BF1 DLC and it will bring the Russian army, four new maps, new weapons and more to Xbox One PS4 and a PC. DICE typically puts several months in between its DLC releases, so we don't expect the next DLC to be out in April or May. Rather, we'd expect it to be out sometimes after Nival Night, possibly in July or August. After that, DICE will release the Turning Tides DLC, the Apocalypse DLC, monthly patches and, if we're lucky, free maps that fall outside the DLC expansions. Thanks for tuning in. A like and subscribe is always appreciated. Until next time, my name is Snaptic and I'll catch you guys on the next video.